NHS IPO has finally gone through after two failed attempts, giving its private equity owners, BC Partners, some relief. But the modest 7% rise in shares post-listing sends a clear message. The market isn't thrilled, and other private equity firms looking to exit might want to take note. Back in 2020, Springer Nature aimed for a billion euro float, but had to pull back. This time, they went with a smaller 600 million euro offer, cutting net debt to 2.7 times EBITDA. Advisors like Deutsche Bank and JP Morgan set the IPO price low, valuing the company at 4.5 billion euros, well below rivals like Elsevier and Taylor & Francis. There's some upside though. Springer Nature's strategy of offering free educational content is driving growth. Last year, it outpaced its competitors, boosting revenue by 5.2% compared to Elsevier's 4% and Taylor & Francis' 3%. Despite this growth, the low valuation and cautious investor response suggests that private equity firms will need to temper their expectations. Springer Nature's experience is a lesson for buyout shops. The market favors caution and discounts, especially in today's environment. For those holding on to companies like Stata or WS Audiology, this IPO serves as a reality check. Exiting at a premium isn't guaranteed.